Well, groundbreaking research by the CSIRO was offering life-changing hope to people suffering from type 2 diabetes. The two-year study found some diabetics on a low-carb diet no longer needed their medication. When Stephen Barnett was diagnosed with type 2 diabetes, he knew he had to make a change. I guess step one for me was not to <laughs> progress to having to have insulin. The 65-year-old becoming part of a CSIRO trial. Researchers comparing whether a low-carb diet high in protein and good fats could help type 2 diabetics better manage their condition than the high-carb, low-fat diet traditionally recommended. While both diets resulted in weight loss, diabetics on the low-carb diet showed greater improvements in their blood cholesterol and glucose levels, so much so they were able to significantly reduce their medication or in some cases stop it altogether. Definitely life-changing. We saw some people in the study completely come off all diabetes medications and that their blood glucose became normal. For Stephen, two years on the trial left him 19 kilograms lighter and healthier. Certainly to see your weight fall off um, was good and uh, the actual published results um, are excellent so it was a great trial. In Australia, one person develops diabetes every five minutes. 85% of cases are type 2, with the major causes obesity and lack of exercise. We don't know everyone in Australia who has got diabetes, a lot of it's undetected, but uh, the ones we do know about, the prevalence is increasing. By adopting the low-carb diet, researchers believe it could stop those at risk from developing the condition. They're pushing for the dietary recommendations for diabetics to be revised. This is really going to start to make us rethink about our dietary guidelines for diabetes management. Jessica Stanley, Nine News.